matter if you're a language learner. You know, you know, you know. Do anything that you love doing most when learning a language. Don't do care. Imagine. Your problem is just time. Like clockwork, community is very important. Do what works for you. You want out, you don't have any time. When you're a language learning slow and you want to get out of it, you keep what hard, previous to know all that. Shall you? And welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Chuku Testimony for my years. And welcome. I also recently just experienced this. I mean, I have experienced it multiple times, but it's just recent that I figured out a few ways or methods that can help me or any other person or you watching to get back on track with your language learning. And the see. first point, the first method, the first thing that could help you is changing the settings on your phone now this is not my current phone i'm using my phone to film but i also sometimes use this one it has been in english for a very long time so i decided to change the settings on my phone and i changed this one to russian which is one of the languages i'm learning and like clockwork i just consciously became more conscious of the fact that oh I actually have a language that I'm learning, that I speak, that I'm getting better at, and that is Russian. Because instead of seeing Monday, 5th of August, I would see Panedianic, Piaf Augusta. You know, changing the language settings on your phone is a very good idea. However, I just realized that if you're a beginner, beginner, like I'm a beginner in, for example, Korean, I would not be able to function at all with my phone if it was in Korean. So this tip is mostly for people who have I honestly think it's a very good tip and it's a very good starting point. Tip number two is listen to songs in the target language. Now, if you're a language learner, you know that songs really help, be it Christian gospel songs or be it um, general, very popular songs in that language. That will just naturally, you know, get you back into the vibe, into the zone of language learning. You're listening to a song and you hear a word or two that you've never heard before going to look up that word in the first place is part of the whole process you're already registering it in your brain i assume that you would already have a few songs downloaded or a few songs that you've listened to once or twice in that language on youtube be it short songs long songs any type of chant or something that has a meaning that you can listen to you could just sing along with the song and unconsciously you start hearing a few words and being able to pronounce them even though we don't know the meaning of those words that can also help Je chanterai de tout So yeah, that's what I mean so mm -hmm. The third point is watch your favorite movie in that language Whatever movie that's currently trending that you would like to watch Try your best to watch it in that language. Now, if it is an English movie, try watching it with subtitle. If that's not an option and the ones that you want to watch you don't have subtitles, try finding a very nice movie with a recommendation that is in that target language and watch it. This can also, like I said, unconsciously help you to get back into it. This can also, if you're a new language learner, help you learn the new language. By watching it, you're learning your expressions. Your brain is getting used to the language again. Clearly, if you haven't looked at it or heard, heard the language in a few weeks or in a few months, because you're not surrounded by people who speak it or something like that. Before I get into the fourth point, as you have been seeing so far, you realize that these methods are just you basically doing things that take the least effort in learning that language or doing the thing that you love doing most when learning a language yours might be reading a book one of the best ways for you to start getting back into trap would just be reading a book in that target so language. the first point is watching your favorite content creators if your favorite content creators are people who speak the language that you already know that you are brought up with then I would advise watching their video with subtitles and if you don't have subtitles, like I've said before find vloggers who speak that your target language I keep saying vlogs because vlogs are just more fun and very easy to use to learn a language because it's like daily life and everyday words 
that people do. This is somehow the fifth point. I'm not even sure if it's a point at all. For some of you, your problem is just time. Okay, your problem is just sitting down for a good 30 minutes or 20 to 30 minutes and studying that language. This also leads me to a connecting point, which is that community is very important. If you have friends and classmates already that speak that language, reach out to them. They could advise you on one or two things to do, or they could even start speaking with you again, which will obviously challenge you by the time they speak one or two words I don't understand, challenge you to learn more, to start studying again. If you've never had a community or you don't know people, you can, you know, there are apps that can provide for that and there are community maybe on facebook on instagram you could also join already discord that will connect you to a few people that speak the language that you're trying to learn so basically do what works for you among all these tips and methods find the one that that you like best the one that excites you the most and it's easy to get out of the slump of whatever language that you are in so yeah this is the end of the video i hope that this video helped I hope that you can take a few of the tips I mentioned and apply them to yourself and I hope that you get out of that language learning slump. Please like this video if it helped you, subscribe and turn on the notification bell because I know that you really like the videos that are yet to come. Once again, my name is Chuku Testimony Moanyaj and thank you for watching. Bye, adios, anyo, au revoir, paka paka! Please like this video if it helped if it helped you or if you enjoy it subscribe and turn on the notification. Do you even know what what happened? I don't even think I'll use this video. I don't know. I don't know if the the chaoticness of the video will come out or if it's just me and I edit it out. Honestly speaking.